Giving a speech is hard for anyone. It's all, it's, sorry. For some, it's the scariest moment in their lives. At first, the very thought of speaking in front of people petrified me. Time and time again, I would try to speak, and nothing would come out. It felt as if someone was stealing my voice, and I was helpless. This class helped change that. This class being public speaking. The class I thought that would not help me, turned out it did. My first speech. My speech has always hindered my ability to say what I want. The night before my self-introduction speech, which is me introducing myself to the class, I frantically changed words in order to not have a block or a stammer. I changed words on purpose because I was afraid of stuttering. As I came up to the podium, it felt as if I was locked in place, unable to move or utter a syllable. I felt the redness in my cheek burn with embarrassment as I tried to make the time limit of three minutes. Three minutes. My eyes tried to maintain eye contact with all of you, with the whole audience, but it was to no avail. In the middle of a quarter, my speech began to flow as I was becoming more comfortable in the class. With a few speeches under my belt, I could see that my speeches were in fact becoming better, and I was meeting the time limit and getting with within that time frame. It was great. As I walked to the podium this time, I felt calm and at ease, and able to say what I would like, despite a few stutters here and there, but it was fine. Strong support that I had for my class gave me the realization that anything is possible. Even if you have a stutter, anything is possible. Today, my speech has allowed me to get to this point. This point in time, as I was, excuse me, just like a soldier on a battlefield, standing up straight, gun in arms, staring at the encroaching enemy, coming towards you slowly, banner raving in the wind. I no longer felt the urge to run away from the encroaching enemy. So I stood firm, met the challenge head on, and killed the bugger. No longer was I afraid. Before this class, I was very introverted and refused to participate in discussions. Now, I'm starting to become more involved which has helped me have an enjoyable college experience. <laughs> Imagine that. Dr. Daniel Huddock, a speech and language pathologist at Idaho State University, explained that I stutter as well. Accepting this fact, along with teaching others, is what I strive for in my career. Yes, I've come a long way despite a stutter. All of you, that means all of you too, especially you, played a vital role in my progress. Today, I am proud to say, I have the courage to stand up in front of an audience and say what I want. Thank you. Thank you very much.